80 years ago, Jacksonville Beach was a rural, thinly inhabited town, and a few people, they had a crazy idea. Their idea? To plant a church out in what was then considered the sticks. So fast forward to today, and that small town, it's become a massive community of people and progress. And that church, well, it's the one we're sitting currently in, affectionately known in our community as Beach Church, perfectly positioned by God to reach it all. And 2018 was no different. Over the past year, Beach Church continued the tradition of living submitted to God's plan. And just look at what happened with God at the driver's seat. We partnered with organizations in our community to be for the beaches. Why? Because God is for all people. Our calling towards the community is no different. You know, the Great Commission that Jesus shared with us means that we are actually to share Jesus both near and far. We're to go to the ends of the earth. So you know what? We ventured locally and abroad to share the gospel, to raise up leaders in other communities, and to deepen our understanding of true servanthood. We championed others around God's vision for Beach Church, raised up thousands around His word and truth, watched God take more than 300 people from death to life, and more than 60 people get baptized. We love our Sunday mornings at Beach Church, don't we? When we dive into God's Word, when we gather week after week to seek what He has to teach us, we have real conversations addressing the world that we live in, and we, above all, worship Him. Hey, and don't forget, we stepped into exciting new adventures and launched our first ever official internship program, and we raised up eight incredible young leaders young men, young women, whose life ahead of them means impacting thousands of others for Jesus. 2018 was an incredible year. It was a year that showed us what is possible when we surrender to God's calling on our lives, we marvel at His plan being released upon the world. So, with 2019 ahead of us, the word surrender once again before us, our hearts and our minds focused on Jesus, Fasten your seatbelts, church, because we're keeping God in the driver's seat. We're ready for another year of being a part of His plan, being released upon our community and the world, and give praise to God for the great things that He has done.